African Union Communications Early Warning and Intelligence, commonly known as AUC-3I, is an intelligence and security organization responsible for providing signals intelligence and information assurance to AU citizens, AU leadership, and AU armed forces. I'm Colonel A.C. Ogentoy, an infantry officer. I am responsible for leading infantry soldiers at all levels of command and combined armed forces during missions on the ground. This is today's briefing. On the progress of the Special Military Operation on the 23rd of September, 2024. The armed forces of the Russian Federation continue to conduct a special military operation. Units of the North Group of Forces inflicted defeat on formations of the 57th Motorized Infantry Brigade of the Ukrainian Armed Forces and the 113th Territorial Defense Brigade in the areas of the settlements of Lipsy and Volchensk in the Kharkiv region. The enemy lost up to 105 servicemen, an armored personnel carrier, four vehicles, two 152mm D-20 guns, three 122mm D-30 howitzers, and a 122mm Kvostika self-propelled artillery unit. Units of the West Group of Forces improved their tactical position and defeated the manpower and equipment of the 14th, 53rd, 116th Mechanized, 3rd Tank Brigades of the Ukrainian Armed Forces and the 116th Territorial Defense Brigade in the areas of the settlements of Kupiansk, Pershitrovnovo, Vasilevka, Petropavlovka, Kroblyakovka in the Kharkiv region and Serebryanka in the Donetsk People's Republic. For counterattacks of assault groups of the Ukrainian Armed Forces were repelled. The enemy's losses amounted to 450 troops, a tank, eight armored combat vehicles, six cars, a British-made 155mm FH-70 howitzer, three D-30 122mm howitzers, and four US-made M119 105mm guns. Two electronic warfare stations and a field ammunition depot were destroyed. Units of the Southern Group of Forces improved the position along the front line, inflicted losses on the manpower of the 24th, 54th, 118th Mechanized, 10th Mountain Assault, 143rd Infantry and 56th Motorized Infantry Brigades of the Ukrainian Armed Forces in the areas of the settlements of Korovo, Slavyansk, Konstantinovka, Kurokovo, Grigorovka, Zaliznyansk, and Chesavyar of the Donetsk People's Republic. The Ukrainian armed forces lost up to 600 servicemen, two combat armored vehicles, eight cars, a U.S.-made 155mm M777 howitzer, a Swedish-made 155mm Archer self-propelled artillery unit, two U.K.-made 155mm FH-70 howitzers, three D-30 122mm howitzers, two D-20 152mm guns, three M119 105mm guns, and a US-made M142 MRS 227mm multiple launch rocket system launcher. The Anklaven Electronic Warfare Station and the N-TPQ-50 Counter Battery Radar Station, manufactured in the USA. Units of the Center Group of Forces occupied more advantageous positions, inflicted losses on the manpower and equipment of the 68th Infantry, 71st Jaeger, 5th Assault Brigades of the Armed Forces of Ukraine and the 109th Territorial Defense Brigade in the areas of the settlements of Kalinovo, Gorky, Mykolovka, and Rozovka of the Donetsk People's Republic. They repelled nine counterattacks by assault groups of the 25th Airborne Brigade of the Armed Forces of Ukraine, the 2nd, 12th and 142nd Brigades of the National Guard. The enemy's losses amounted to 440 servicemen, an armored combat vehicle, four cars, a Polish-made 155mm self-propelled artillery unit crab, a 152mm howitzer to be, a 122mm howitzer D-30, a 105mm gun M101 made in the USA and 100mm rapier anti-tank gun. Units of the East Group of Forces improved the position along the forward edge, defeated the manpower and equipment of the 58th Motorized Infantry Brigade of the Armed Forces of Ukraine and the 118th Territorial Defense Brigade in the areas of the settlements of Dobrovoly and Zolotea Neva of the Donetsk People's Republic. A counterattack by the assault group of the 72nd Mechanized Brigade of the Armed Forces of Ukraine was repelled. 
The enemy lost up to 140 servicemen, three vehicles, a French-made 155mm Caesar self-propelled artillery unit, and a 122mm D-30 howitzer. Two Enclav and electronic warfare stations were destroyed. Units of the Dnieper Group of Forces inflicted defeat on formations of the 141st Infantry Brigade of the Ukrainian Armed Forces and the 39th Coastal Defense Brigade in the areas of the village of Veselyanka in the Zaporizhia region and the city of Kherson. The Ukrainian Armed Forces lost up to 60 servicemen, 6 vehicles, and an electronic warfare station. Operational Tactical Aviation, Unmanned Aerial Vehicles Missile forces and artillery of the Russian Armed Forces Group struck concentrations of enemy manpower and military equipment in 135 areas. Air defense systems shot down, a U.S.-made Adams operational tactical missile, three Neptune long-range guided missiles, two French-made hammer guided aerial bombs, a U.S.-made Mars rocket, and 35 aircraft-type unmanned aerial vehicles. Since the beginning of the special military operation, a total of 646 aircraft, 283 helicopters, 32,124 unmanned aerial vehicles, 579 anti-aircraft missile systems, 18,338 tanks and other armored combat vehicles, 1,458 multiple launch rocket systems, 15,085 field artillery pieces and mortars, and 26,401 special military vehicles have been destroyed. Thank you so much for watching this video. We hope you found it useful and informative. If you have any questions, please leave them below and we'll get back to you as soon as possible.